Everybody. Welcome to the Chef Central live stream. All right, this is the second what Chef Central studio session. Let me know if y'all can hear me right now. Um, you guys are home inside of Chef Central, man. It has been a long time since I seen you guys. Well, it feel like it's been a long time, man. Time just be traveling for me. But go ahead if you're here right now. Let me know where you're watching the stream from. Uh, right now, I'm in California, Fresno. If you guys know what that is, I'm in Fresno, California, trying to make stuff happen, still grinding, you know. Hold up, let me take the rapper shades off real quick. I'm out here grinding in Cali, man, just trying to make something happen for myself, man. So I hope a lot of y'all are uh, doing the same thing, man. Like, ooh, excuse me. Got all this energy pent up in me because I've been waiting on this session for like the last two weeks, and uh, I'm just excited. I'm happy. Uh, let me get into the comments right quick before... Uh, People start saying I'm ignoring people. What's going on, Tony? What's good? My boy James. What's good, man? Woo! Man, I'm excited for tonight's session, man. Um, Tonight, what I wanted to do is... uh, So, I know a lot of you guys... You guys haven't heard like a lot of my older stuff. So, tonight's session, man, we taking it back. Because I got some hits, man. I got some jams. And it's time... It's really time for the world to recognize like I'm the GOAT. Like... Because I've been doing this since I was 17, like, I'm 47 right now. So it's been, like, you know, years and time in the making for, like, the world just to hear this shit, man. So we tonight's session, we're going to go back to some oldies, some of my oldies. It's going to be new to y'all, but uh, we're just going to get right into it. Um, like I said earlier, 
Let me know where you guys are checking in from. We all in this together, you know, during this crazy, crazy, you know, crisis that we in. But we can't do nothing. We can't think negative. We just got to, you know, think positive and keep doing what we already been doing. So uh, I'm about to go ahead and get into the first track. And uh, I'm going to give what I'm going to do for you guys tonight, man, as I'm playing the music, I'm going to give you guys, you know, a little behind the scenes on, you know, like some of the songs that, you know, how they came together. And just, you know, commentary, all that good stuff. But let's get into it. This is the first song. The first song is called, uh, man, I, I made this six years ago. Wow. Okay, so this EP that I'm about to play for you guys before I get into it. I'm going to play the music. I'm going to play the music. But just let me let me let y'all know the behind the scenes. Um, this EP is from my EP when I made when I was living in Japan, right? So if y'all don't know me, uh, I used to be in the military. Um... And uh, I lived in Japan for four years, and that was like the best time of my life. So I made an EP uh, album, mixtape or whatever, to kind of like represent, you know, just my time, you know, there. And I met a lot of cool people, but without further ado, we go get into it, man. We go get into the first track, one of the first tracks of the night. It's called Riding With The Team. Let me know what you guys think after this, man. It's a classic. Let's go. Gotta put my rapper shades on right quick. Hold on. Team. No, 
blow with me, then you ride with the team. So fine, blow with me, come and ride with the team. Don't you lie, come with me, go and ride with the team. Hey, so that track, man, that shit, man, low key took me back in time. But that track was like a, a compilation of like a lot of like talented people that I met in the military. And man, like, like this project that I did, it's low key slept on. Low key. It's low key slept on because, like, man, like the world didn't get to hear this, but it's all good because the world's gonna hear this shit right now. But man, yeah, but. The name of the song is Riding Riding with the Team. I was on the hook. I didn't spit a verse nothing like that. But uh, it's featuring my girl Erica Sorok, my boy uh, Juan, my boy Jay Lando, and my boy Kid Swag, man. Like, man, like, I got some hits, low key. Like, man, like, no, I'm, I'm gonna get back. I'm gonna get back to the, the session because, like, I could talk about myself all day. But uh, shout out to everybody that's just now tuning in. Chef Central live stream, man. Let me know where you guys rocking from. Shout out to my boy Flocko for pulling up, my boy Reed, my girl Meg. Everybody that's in here showing love, man. My boy Tony, what's good? Boy, I didn't miss you, man. But yeah, I came prepared for you guys too, man. Like, I also wanted to, uh, I got some notes. Came prepared, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I also want to show some love to my boy Ken Leon, man. Shout out to my boy Ken Leon for blessing me with this, uh, MIDI keyboard, man. Your boy finna be on some Kanye shit now. Now that I got the MIDI keyboard, your boy about to be producing beats, so... Holla at your boy Chef if you need some beats, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm about to go in. But, yeah, man, it's just great. Um, and I'm just really in a good place, man. Hopefully you guys are in a good place, too. Hopefully you guys are still, you know, being positive and motivated during this crazy time. I know it's hard to stay positive and motivated, but just really trying to really try to find that thing that you believe in and just go for it. And that's what I'm doing right now. Like, I tell people all the time, like, I'm no different from, like, anybody that's watching this. Like, I'm just a regular dude with a dream, and I'm chasing it, so... Y'all get to watch me chase it, so, and be a part of it as well, so, shout out to everybody tuning in. Make sure y'all hit that like button, please, because when y'all do that, man, it helps, you know, this video get shown to the world and stuff like that, and I don't have to pay for ads, but <laughs> we gonna keep it going. We, uh, finna get into the next track. This next track, man, it's, it's another banger, but I'm gonna let it speak for itself. It's called Make It Clap. It's featuring me. I got a verse on it. Um, it's with my boy Jay Lando and my boy KSO. Let me know what you guys think after this. Let's go. Let's hear it. Oh, I forgot my rapper shades. I'm sorry. Hold up. And there we go. This is a banger. Jay Lando killed that shit, man. Shout out to Jay Lando, man.
that was Make It Clap, man. That's a banger still to this day. I made that, well, we made that song, um, 2014, 2013. And, uh, yeah, to answer your question, Reed, that's a, a too short sample on the chorus. So, um, yeah. Like, we was going in, like, low-key. Like, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna tell you guys a secret. I'm gonna re-put this project out because, um, I put it out and, um, you know, it didn't go the way I wanted it to go. You know, um, I put it out when I put it out during the time, right? Because like in the military, right? In the military, you have orders, right? And um, all my friends that got on this project, they were all in the military, right? So during like the time, like when everybody had to leave, man, like it, it was it was literally just hard to like really just like promote this project the right way. Just because, like, by the time, like, all the songs got finished and, like, put together, you know, everybody was going different places. Like, I was leaving Japan. I was coming to California. And my friends, like, they were, like, getting orders to, like, being scattered across the world and stuff like that. So, this EP really didn't get the push that it deserves. But it's all good. Chef finna take care of it. You know what I'm saying? Like, we finna go in and, like, once this project, like, just takes off. Because, like, if you guys haven't listened to my music now... Like, I have a catalog of, like, a lot of, like, gems, low-key. So, if you're watching this live stream right now, I probably want to go back and do the research on all the songs that I got out. Because I got some bangers. And it's just a matter of time before, like, stuff takes off. And I'm going to keep, you know, doing stuff. But, uh, shout out to Reed, man. Reed said, it's fire. Appreciate that, bro. Shout out to Flacco. Flacco said, it's fire. Hey, bro. It's crazy because, like, this is, you know, it's new to you guys, but it's old to me. So, like, it's really, like, good to hear... That, you know, stuff that I made in my past still resonates, you know, till today, you know, with an extent. So, um, yeah, I'm excited. Um, let me see. What else? We got... It's, man, this EP was so slip on. I'm going to play for y'all this next track. I think this this track was low-key a uh, banger, too. So, let me know what you guys think after this track. This is Win here featuring um, yeah. Fat yeah. Trey and Pyrex Pots. And your boy, of course. Will of course it. We in this bitch, bitch. Hoes go retarded when we walking through the door. Popped a couple mollies, now they all up on the floor. Every night's a party, nigga, all we see is dope. See them stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch, we in this bitch, we in this bitch, we in this bitch, yeah, oh, we in this bitch. Popped a couple mollies, now they all up on the floor. Stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch. Yeah, that nigga bitch. so clean. Dope gang so mean. Hoes bounce so mean. No, 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 no trampoline. So fresh, watch me. Kill the game on my team. Popping bottles, I be. The king of VIP. We show up and they go crazy. These hoes wanting my babies. I told them once and I'll tell them twice. I ain't trying to catch rabies. We pull up in a Mercedes. Now we in this bitch like a baby. We make Rain on Stacy and we ballin' like the old Casey. These models want a few dollars. We take them all to McDonald's. And trick your man, you slip your man. See, real niggas don't bother. We pay for these hoes with us, they come for free. I keep fucking with them hood rats and they'll eat up all your cheese. Hoes go retarded when we walkin' through the door. Popped a couple mollies, now they all up on the floor. Every, every, every night's a party, nigga, all we see is dope. See them stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch. We in this bitch. We in this bitch. We in this bitch. Yeah, oh, we in this bitch. Popped a couple mollies, now they all up on the floor. See them stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch. Fat Trey, yeah, he in his bitch. Shout out to Fat Trey. Getting money, fucking hoes, yeah, I'm getting this. Stuntin' on your fucking legs. Fuck your bitch shit with the game. Got a couple guns, baby, y'all gon' bang. No, I'm not fucking up with you, man. Yeah, but I keep some bad hoes. Running through the club, got the ladies on froze. Pulling on my shirt, trying to smell my cologne. Tell them all to just leave me alone. Yeah, cause I'm married to my moolah. That's my whole team, yeah. We done all ran through high. So next time, do a better job of knowing that we in this bitch. Hoes go retarded when we walking through the door. Popped a couple mollies, now they all up on the floor. 
every, every night's a party, nigga. I always see his dope. See them stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch. We in this bitch. We in this bitch. We in this bitch. Yeah, ho, we in this bitch. Pop a couple mollies, now they all up on the floor. Stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch. We in this bitch, my whole team be killing shit. With all these trees lit, you don't think that it's Christmas. And ain't no stopping it, cause we say I'm on one. I'll take your bitch, drink a little bit, and have a lot of fun. My clique is geeked up, these hoes they freaked out. You ain't talking about that money, then I don't know what you talking about. Lame niggas they talking down, because I'm getting dope. I took your hoe, you already know that she put on the show. I told her bye. Round of applause, no hesitation, their conversation straight to them draws. Be on that fly shit, auto, auto pilot. Drop it down, pick it up, now rewind it. Hoes go retarded when we walking through the door. Pop the couple mileage, now they all up on the floor. Every, every, every night's a party, nigga, I always see his dope. See them stacks and rubber bands, how you know? We in this bitch, we in this bitch, we in this bitch. We in this bitch, yeah, ho, we in this bitch Pop a couple mileage, now they all up on the floor Stacks and rubber bands, how you know We in this bitch Hey, so the name of that song was called We in this bitch And like, for me, y'all, it's so crazy me hearing that Because like, at that age When I was making like songs and stuff like this Like, I really didn't, hold up It's time to get serious, gotta take the rapper shades off at the age when I made, like, this song, like, it's a banger and all that, but I didn't realize, like, you know, the power that music has over people. So, I'm saying this right now. Like, when I put this out, like, you know, don't take none of the stuff that I was saying, like, serious. Because, like, I was talking about, like, popping mollies and all this stuff. Like, like I never popped no mollies. It just sounded good, you know, for me, you know, because, like, that was the time period when, like, that was, I guess, like, it was cool to say stuff like that. But... When I was younger, I really didn't understand, like, the power of music. So, you know, I, I really want anybody that's listening to me, I don't want to influence you guys in the wrong way and turn you guys to drugs or, like, do, like, you know, crazy stuff, you know. Um, and that's me just, you know, taking responsibility, I think, like, as an artist. Because, like, I think uh, for, like, a lot of artists, you know, they say a lot of stuff and they, they don't realize, like, how much music has, like, an impact on people, especially the youth. So... Um, you know, listening to my music, you know, I hope, hopefully, hopefully if you're hearing this right now, you know, you ain't going down a rabbit hole of doing a lot of crazy stuff that I used to promote, you know, in my music, but it's whatever. But, uh, yeah, that's crazy. Um, just hearing all this, like, all these songs, like, it's crazy because, like, it takes me, like, in a, like, it takes me to a crazy place, like, Man, like, this is low-key good. Like, man, like, I feel like stuff like this can be put out today. Because I feel like I make music way better. Like, I'm going to keep it real. Like, I'm just spitting the facts tonight. Like, I feel like I make way better music than, like, what y'all are hearing right now. But it's just, like, th the music that y'all are hearing right now, it never, got a, it never got its proper shine. It never got, you know, its chance to, you know, just be heard by the world. But that's what this is here for uh, right now. Um... And shout out to everybody that played a part of this tape, man, because, you know, these are all talented individuals. And, you know, I was lucky, you know, to just get all these group of people and uh, put them on this uh, EP. And I met them all in the military. So that's it's it's just really crazy. It's like just hearing this like, man, like, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to go on like a, you know, a rant and like that. But, man, this this stuff is crazy. But I want to pause the music uh, for a little bit. And I want to ask you guys, like. What have you guys been doing, like, you know, with this whole quarantine, like, thing going on? Like, it's, I know a lot of people have been, like, distressed, and um, I'm lucky to be able, to, I'm lucky enough to be able to be doing, like, these studio sessions and making, like, you know, videos and content and stuff like that, but I know a lot of people around the world are just, you know, sad and, like, bored and don't have nothing to do, so my question for you guys, you know, let me know in the comments. What have you guys been doing for yourself, like, during this whole, um, quarantine, um, this whole isolation thing? Um, hopefully it's been something productive, but if not, then, you know, you can, now's the time you can, you know, just work your way towards, like, whatever you want to do in life, honestly. 
Um, so let me know what you guys are doing, and if I can help, I'll be gladly to help, you know, if I can. But other than that, we finna keep the fucking party going, man. This ain't no fucking sad ass live stream. This the fucking Chef Central Studio session number two. So we finna go right back in. I'm finna play y'all a jam, right? This was me and my boy K Young. Y'all probably heard of K Young. Some of y'all probably not. But this is my boy K Young. Me and him did this collab. So let me know what you guys think in the comments of this song right here. I think this is probably one of the best songs in the tape, but we're gonna get right back into it. What's good, my boy Jeremiah? I see you pulled up. My boy Reed said he'd been gardening. Hell yeah, man. Bro, I'm thinking about doing that shit too. Low key. But I'm about to get back into the music right quick. And then I'll probably take a break from the music and get into the comments and stuff like that. Because I don't want to talk to myself the whole time. You know I love talking to y'all. So let's get right back into the music. And uh, we'll go from there. Oh, shit. I forgot my rapper. When I do it like this, her body go. I'm going to do it like that just a little more. He's the real boss. Just come be with me. We be chillin' in the fast lane. Got your man mad for the things in his gas tank. What up, Sam? Get down, boy. Get big. Yo, so that was I Like uh, featuring my boy K Young. Man, like I said earlier, man, it just, when I hear like all these songs, like they just take me to this, like to a place. Like for the people that's watching now or just like now tuning in, like um, we playing my um, 2014 EP Turn Up. Uh, it's the EP I made when I was in Japan. And just, man, like I'm the GOAT. Like it's time to give it up. Like, it's time to give it up. That's what I took from that. Like, I'm just a GOAT. Because the thing is, like, I really, like, progressed so, so, so much, man. And it's just, like, 
Well, I feel like I progressed so much. And um, just hearing that and just hearing that it's still good, that's just like, man, like, I'm like fine wine, man. Get better over time, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, man, I'm going to go back and do, like, what I promised myself, you know, once I get to the place where I need to be. Hold on, I'm going to take the rapper shades off so y'all take me serious. I, I promised myself when I get to the place where I need to be, like, all my old shit, man, it's just go, like, get fucking, like, brought to the light because like i got a lot of old shit that is just like gems and um you know when i was coming up as an artist i really didn't understand like why why like i would put out good song after good song after good song after good song after good song and i'd be like why why is nobody listening like is this trash and that was like a hard thing for me to get over um when i first started making music but um now i finally come to a point where um i don't really do music for that and I know the reasoning behind like a lot of stuff. So it's just literally for me just um, taking stuff day by day and just continuing the process, man. Because when it eventually happens, like it's going to fucking take off, man. It's going to go crazy. And you guys is watching this. Y'all going to be a part of it, man. Like, because honestly, that's what I do it for. I do it for you guys, man. Oh, yeah. Special shout out. I didn't forget. I wrote it down on my notes. Special shout out to all my viewers from uh, Belgium, man. All my people in Belgium, they've been showing me a lot of love out there. I got to come out there, man, whenever, you know, this uh, crazy pandemic we have going on slows down. But shout out to all my viewers from Belgium. Shout out to everybody tuning in this part to the live stream, man. Like, I really appreciate, like, y'all tuning in with your boy. I'm finna go into these comments right quick. Make sure I don't uh, forget nothing. Um, my boy Jeremiah said, that beat is hard. Hey, appreciate it, bro. It's a beat. Like, from 2014, too. So, you saying it's hard today? Shh. That just only says, I'm the GOAT. But, yeah. My boy Jeremiah also said, you're trying to teach your three-year-old stepdaughter to read books. Man, bro, like, you know what's crazy? It's a good thing you said that. Before I get into the next song, I got a crazy theory, right? You want to hear my theory? I think, right, the kids that are being, um that were born in like the last five years, last six years, seven years, the kids that aren't really in school yet, depending on how long, you know, this crazy stuff lasts, like, kids are going to be like learning stuff from YouTube, man. Like, kids are going to like figure out, you know, that the stuff that we learn in school, you know, isn't, you know, the stuff that they, you know, really care about really early. And that's thanks to like, you know, technology and stuff like that. Um, technology has uh enabled us to you know search for the things that we want and um even with like social media and like all these platforms and stuff like they know us like you know you probably you guys probably like look at your youtube and stuff like that and see that it's catered you know to all the stuff that you care about without you even like knowing it so it just shows you how smart like these algorithms and all these platforms and stuff are getting so i think it's really it's a really interesting time that we're in right now Especially with kids, like Jeremiah, you say you're teaching your um, kid how to read, and that's great, man. Like I wish I had a you know kid to teach and you know pass on the ropes and just you know and just you know help them learn in this crazy world because man, we we just in a crazy time right now. But I'm blessed and I'm fortunate to uh, be doing the stuff that I'm doing, uh, doing what I love, and uh, trying to help people get to where trying to help people get to where they need to be. So. I don't know. It's just been a great ride for me, guys. And, I, and I, like I said, I can't say thank you enough for everybody that's tuning in uh, to the studio session. But we're about to hop right back in it. I'm about to put the rapper shades right back on because it's time to get for real. And uh, the next track, let me know what you guys think. Uh, the next track is called Everywhere. And right before I get into this song, man, I'm going to go ahead and give you all a quick synopsis of it. I wrote this song, man, because I was in lovely uh, Fukuoka, Japan, man. And like, I was literally, like, just walking, like, the malls and, like, the streets and stuff. And, like, it was literally just, like, beautiful, like, just women everywhere, man. And um, I just felt the need to write a song about it. So, uh, <laughs> that's the quick preview of the song. <laughs> Here it is. I love this song. Love it. Got Is everywhere, all the guys they all go studies bad. Chicks they everywhere, have a fun, they all like, yeah, bad. Chicks they everywhere, dancing wild, they all don't care. Who bad, and you know it, know it. Why you man so bogus, girl, stop playing. I want it, and got you got me 
This is a club banger. Yo, yo, when this, all right, so I just came up with a, with a huge promise, like, during that, guys, so, when this is over, when everything's said and done, and when stuff takes off to where it needs to be, man, like, I'm throwing a fucking chef fest, man, because just listening to, like, listening to all this shit that I got, like, this deserves to be, like, a fucking, like, a big ass event like fucking party and it's just gonna be like the wildest the biggest like shit ever man because like we need something like when all this shit is over we coming out of this like on top everybody's watching this shit like we coming out of this on top and i just can't wait man like i like i'm not trying to gas myself because i always do but it's over man like the sky's the fucking limit and like I'm excited because my my dream concert is just me just you know in front of like a million people and just fucking everybody going crazy, everybody having that fucking energy, you know what I'm saying? And if you just like standing there on your phone looking like stupid and shit like that, you getting kicked the fuck out, you know? Because we're here to have a good fucking time and just you know to spread that fucking energy and just go in. So. When I have a show and you guys, you guys gonna be a part of it. Like y'all, y'all good. Yeah. Man, it's gonna be so so crazy. Like I'm telling you, especially like with my new stuff coming out. Like with my new stuff, oh my god. Like it's just gonna be a great time, man. It's like for me, it's it's what a time to be a lot. Like we're right now, we're in like a time where you can literally do anything, man, anything. And I'm just so grateful. I am grateful. Just I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna shut up. I'm on my soapbox and shit like that, but let me know what you guys uh, think, think about that track. Um, that song is called Everywhere, and that is also on the TU EP that I dropped in 2014. I might have to re-upload it, low key. I might. That's what I might do for y'all. I might end up, after the stream, I might go ahead and upload this to Spotify. Just in case some of you guys, you know, liked a lot of the songs. Excuse me. Just in case you guys liked a lot of the songs from the project, uh, and I'm pretty sure you do. But um, I feel like now is the time to put it back up. So, but it's up to you guys. Let me know if you guys want to, you know, want me to put this up on Spotify. If not, I'll uh, continue on with my day. But um, 
Yeah, it's just been a journey, man. Um, and I'm just grateful to be here, like, during the studio session, man. Like, it's just crazy. Like, oh, this is what I wanted to say before I forgot. I almost forgot during the break. Right? This one, this is what I wanted to say, right? Within the next few weeks, shit is about to get crazy. Like, I'm telling y'all. Like, I can't spill the beans, like, with a lot of stuff that's going on or falling into play, but shit is about to get, like, really crazy. So... Um, like I said, I'm just, <sighs> y'all just stay, y'all just stay the course with me. Just, just stick with me. And I promise like shit's just going to be crazy in the future. That's all I can say. I'm trying not to, I'm trying not to say anything without spilling it. But, um, yeah, the future is really bright. The future is really bright here in the Chef Central. And I'm glad to have you guys a part of it, man. I just said I'm glad to have you guys part of it like 20 times, but that's how glad I am. And, um. Yeah, man. Even with all the crazy stuff going on, man, the future is going to be crazy. It's going to be crazy. So, stick with your boy. Stick with your boy, Chef. Trust Chef. Next song we're getting into is, uh, this is another banger. Um, it's called I Got This. Now, some of y'all may have heard this, but, uh, this is one of my first, this is one of my, I, actually, you know what? This is my first music video. So, after y'all get done watching the live stream, Go and watch this video on YouTube. It's called I Got This. And this is my first music video. And like, low key, you could tell it was my first music video. But I'm going to get into the song. Let me know what you guys think after the song. And yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> Man, shout out to, man, 
everybody that played a part in that video, man. Y'all go watch that video on YouTube. Chef Willie, I got this uh, on my YouTube channel. And man, like, ah. Uh... Gotta take the glasses off again. Yo, I was a young goat spitting them bars on that song, man. And um, I just, you know, for me, I always have these moments where, like, I have something to prove. Because, like, for me, I always walk around like I got a chip on my shoulder, right? So, with that being said, like, I make, like, fun music, love music, you know, party music and all that stuff like that. But at a certain point, you know, I got to go in and show people I got them bars, you know. So, um, I got this. I think that was, like, um, for me, it was a combination of me trying to, like, have, like, a, you know, you know, a vibey beat. While spitting them hard ass bars at the same time. So, cause I'm versatile. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't just put me in one box. Like, that's the thing. Like, I can make any. Like, I've gotten to the point, and it's crazy for me to look back and, like, retrospect and see that I can make almost any kind of song at this point. Almost. It's just, for me, like, I don't really try to cater to one style. I kind of try to um, go with the vibe or whatever is going on. And just like release whatever I feel. And I've honestly got to that point as an artist because what I used to do is I used to try to, and which is still good, um, I used to try to, you know, make a body of work, right? And then cater certain songs to that body of work. And that's like time consuming and it serves its purpose for what it, what, you know, the need is, you know, because I consider myself an album artist, right? Back in the day. But um, now it's just, I just like to release whatever is on my mind, honestly. And, um, you know, it's crazy, like, listening to my old music. Um, you know, the direction I was in was, like, crazy. Um, I was just making what I wanted at the time. And, you know, fast forward uh, seven years, well, six years, you know, I'm back doing the same thing. And, um being online live for you guys so that song was i got this um let me know what you guys think of that song um but yeah i think we got two songs left <laughs> i'm sorry guys we only got two songs left from this ep man but you know if you guys want to hear it let me know i'm gonna put it up on spotify itunes um you know just for old time sakes and just for my my team, my fam, man, because it took a lot to go into this project, man. Like, ah, uh, like I might have to make a documentary about this whole project. What's going on, Simba? You sad too? Simba sad. Simba sad too, cause you know the live stream has to come to an end soon. I know, but we got work to do, man. We got work to do. I'm sorry, bro. Like, we got some work to do. But um, yeah. What next song? What is okay? So before I play this next song, right? I'm going to go ahead and give y'all a little quick synopsis, right? So, this song was um, me. <laughs> this song was me trying to, um, you know, go into my top 40 realm. Um, you know, and me, and like like I said, honestly, like, I like to make what I feel. And it's a banger, but I'm going to let y'all judge. I'm going to let y'all hear it, but I fucks with it. I really like the song, but... You win your crew, let's roll. Pool party, my spot, let's go. No shirt, no pants, no clothes. Don't fuck with me, man, let's go. I don't really care about that. I just wanna see you get wet. My dogs, who y'all love cats? And you know that we all love next. Work it out, work it out, don't stop. Let's go. No shirt, no pants, no clothes. Don't fuck the shaman, it's so 
shame No, I'm such a lame So why are you with them, lady? You should have dismissed them, baby Cause you're the victim, baby And girl, I'm trying to you save you Oh, shawty, come to my pool party You and your crew, shawty Come to my pool party You and your crew, shawty Come to my pool party You and your crew, shawty Come to my pool party Like, that was a banger. Like, I could see that song in, like, a fucking Zac Efron movie or, like, some fucking Jonah Hill movie. Like, some kind of, like, fucking party movie or some shit like that. Like, low-key, I'm glad I, like, played that song because now I got some ideas. Now I got some ideas. But that's what, that song was called Pool Party. And that was, uh, you know, inspired by a pool party, obviously. But, uh... Yeah, man, I got some bangers on this tape, man. I got some bangers, but, um, yeah, let me know what you guys think about that song, and we are about to get into the grand finale of the tape, man. I'm sorry, like, I know you guys don't want me to leave, but, you know, I got other stuff I have to do, like edit, shoot videos, record, mix, market, all this other stuff, you know, day in the life of an up-and-coming artist, the, all that kind of stuff, so... This is going to be the last song for the Chef Central Studio session. And um, yeah, we go vibe out to them. This is a banger too, by the way. Thank you. 
say how you move, baby. And she just told me that it's been a while. So tonight she like Big Willie style. Wow. Get jiggy with it. Bad chick, and we know how to get it, get it. And you know that it's just the two of us. So you know just what we about to do, huh? Uh, hey. So you want to come with me? And you want to get friendly? Well, I ain't got no problem. Like it's hot, girl. Now I drop it back to my world. Yeah, I see you. Looking so bad, I see you. All the girls wanna be you. And I just wanna be inside, inside, inside. Willie trying to get right. Wanna take you for a spin like a test drive. Get energized when I get in it. And you know, young Willie, I stay winning. Like Pippin' or Robin. I rhyme all the time, and I'm 23 when I'm real. But that's not important. Let's focus on you right now, girl, cause I want it. Cause you say you wanna come with me. And you wanna get it friendly. Well, I ain't got no problem. Nah, no girl, not at all. Hey, say where you wanna go. Hey, can you let her play? No. And you know I ain't tripping. Why? Cause you know I'm with it. Yo, this is a fucking banger. A fucking banger. This is a fuck. Let me know. This is a fucking banger. Like, I'm going to have to go back and make a video for this. Like, this is how much I believe in this song. Like, this is a banger. Like, I don't care what nobody says. Like, when shit falls into place and it's going to, I'm going to go back and make a fucking music video for this. Because this was a fucking jam like when i made this song the crazy thing about when i made this song i made it when uh what was that song called classic man that song called classic man by jadena all right uh when that song came out like i was like man i really fuck with this song right and i was fucking with the wave the whole like vibe you know all the stuff that was going on during that time and i heard this beat and i'm like yo i need this right now and I just came up with, you know, Come With Me. The song is called Come With Me. Um, and this, this song is actually on um, Spotify and iTunes and stuff right now. So you guys can go and stream that if you guys fuck with it. Go and stream it. But, um, yeah, this is a banger. Like, I'm, I'm going back to shoot this video. I don't care. But that is it as far as the whole um, Turn Up EP. Let me guys know uh, in the timestamps, uh, if you're watching this late, what was your favorite song during the EP? Um, I'm probably going to go ahead and just put it on Spotify for you guys. Um, just for even the people that uh, is watching late or can't even watch it today. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and upload it and I'll uh, fill you guys in on when it's released and stuff like that. But that's it for TU. I'm going to go ahead and close out with my most current song. Invitation. This is your invitation to come and join the chef, man. I'm about to take over the fucking world, man. Like, this shit is crazy. Like, hearing all my old shit just, like, fucking gave me all this fucking energy to go in and, like, kill this shit tonight with this new track that I'm working on that I'm not gonna tell y'all about yet because y'all need to soak this up first. But we'll close out the studio session tonight with uh, my newest song, Invitation. Be sure you go and stream that right now. It's out on Spotify. Stream Invitation, man. We're changing the world. And we're just gonna close out with this, all right? Let's hit it. Uh -huh.
I forgot my rapper shades. My bad. I gotta turn this up. Check out the progression. This the progression. This is right now. studio session man i gotta get back in the studio and make these sets man but appreciate y'all viewing and let's change the game let's take over the world peace